Hi there, this is Mark Brunet and this is the ultimate career guide for 3D artists. So if you've ever considered a career as a 3D artist, this course is definitely for you. So it's my best attempt yet at condensing my 10 years of knowledge working in the game industry into a guide that is packed with content and that covers absolutely everything when it comes to the job of a 3D artist. I've been working in the game industry for many, many years, uh, about 10 years in total. And the last uh, eight of those years were spent at Blizzard Entertainment, where I worked on games like Titan slash Overwatch, Heroes of the Storm, as well as StarCraft. So. Here is what we are going to be covering. The guide is going to be split in seven chapters. So I'll start with the basics of what the job is and what are the different paths that you can take. The second chapter is going to be about the techniques. Uh, since this is aimed at beginners as well as more advanced artists looking for a career bump, uh, I'll cover some extra stuff to bring everybody up to speed. So we'll look at all the software used in the industry and I'll demo in real time two of the most popular pipelines for creating game assets. The third chapter is going to be all about the 3D industry. So those are all the things that I wish I knew uh, before I started. Pretty much everything I can think of as far as what it's like when you actually get in and start working as a professional. And then I'll jump uh, right into the first mega chapter where I'll be covering the entire creation of a hand-painted character from start to finish. So this is gonna be a really, really big chapter. We'll also be building a great base mesh and sculpt that we'll be able to reuse in future projects. And then that brings me to the, the next chapter, which is another monster chapter covering the entire creation of a more current gen PBR character using the base body from the previous chapters. In chapter six, we'll create cool color variations. We'll do a rigging and posing in ZBrush. And also we are going to be uh, looking at how to set up uh, the shaders and the scene to be able to create some awesome shots in Marmoset. This way we'll have some awesome content to upload to our portfolio. The last chapter is going to be all about getting the job. So all the necessary steps that are required. So from exposure, how to get the most exposure and the fastest way possible, to applying, and finally to nailing the interview. Now with the videos, you also get all the extra content, including the base mesh, the base sculpt, and everything else. All the scenes that I'll be creating will be there available for download, just so that you can better follow along. The review so far has been absolutely amazing, so I'm really, really grateful that people are actually enjoying the content. And this should give you a kind of like a good indication of what you can expect from this. All right, and if you do get it, uh, please, please show me you know, the kind of uh, characters that you create out of this or the kind of assets that you create out of this. I'd be so excited to see. Now, we have a ton of content to cover, so let's get started, all right? See you in there.